Welcome to our very first rehearsal. <laughs> okay. What I would like us to do is to start by introducing ourselves in our own different language. Okay, I will start uh, by introducing by greeting in Zulu language, in South African language. So when we greet someone, we say, Saubon. Can you say after me? Saubon. 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 Beautiful. So now, uh, any other language introduction? Uh, greeting? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can you all say? <laughs> Okay, now we say these two greetings. Sawon. 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 Okay, thank you very much. Another greeting. <laughs> Sao bona, sao bona, 
use tonality in languages and culture as well. So I take that and interpret it into melody. So you, there is different kind of waves in language. The other, as we just demonstrated, Sawona, we drop the, the last level and then we go. So there's a difference between between uh -huh. So uh, to me, I hear certain melody navigating through the street. You know, you know, Alors, principalement, mon stratégie pour euh, composer des musiques, c'est d'utiliser la tonalité des langues. Ok. Not only in language, I'm also inspired by the sound in general, in nature. Uh, Pas seulement la, la, la langue, mais aussi le son en général dans la nature. The moving car, the, the wind. Une voiture qui part. Yes. <laughs> so. Uh, the wheels, uh, the roues. Or oh, the car. The car. Uh, uh, the ah, the wind. Yes. The vent. Yes. I hear the wheel. Okay. I would like us to perform. Yes. Did we introduce ourselves? No. Oh. <laughs>
<laughs> Final sound. I'm just going to demonstrate three kinds of, of sound. A snake sound is... What? Oh, yes, yes. And I would like to challenge them tonight. <laughs> so, 
And I'm gonna, when I talk about how I compose with you, I want to involve you, so please stand up. When I tell you how I compose my music, I ask you to participate also. And sit down. Sit down. Sit down. And then I would like you to do it without commenting in between. Don't go so far. So I'm going to say stand up, you stand. Je vous demande, sit down, you sit. Yeah. Je vous demande de le faire sans commenter entre. Stand up. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. It's ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> It's really ridiculous that you are standing up and sitting down, standing down, sitting down. So that's why I want to talk about music as a function. Alors c'est vraiment ridicule non de se lever, s'asseoir, se lever, s'asseoir. Mais maintenant je veux vous parler de la musique avec ses fonctions. We walk every day. We do things every day. So it's the rhythm that comes from everyday things that we do. On marche tous les jours, donc c'est avec le rythme de tous les jours. When you are walking, quand vous marchez, you walk in time. But you never count your steps. Quand vous marchez, vous comptez. But your steps are counting themselves. Vous comptez jamais vos marches. Vos And your body remembers your steps. Mais les pieds vont compter pour eux-mêmes. Sometimes your steps play in your head. Parfois vos pas. Sont en train de jouer dans votre tête. And then when you have that awareness, et quand vous avez cette awareness, euh, cette conscience, you repeat it to yourself. Vous le répétez pour vous-même. Sometimes you are forced. Tu es même resté forcé d'apprendre. When you dealing with the functions of life. Quand vous, vous avez affaire avec les fonctions de la vie. I want to talk about a lot of things, and I'm worried about time. How much time do we have? <laughs> the whole night. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, I I grew up in a place called Polar Park, Swatakam. Je grandis dans un lieu qui s'appelle Polar Park. Polar Park. <laughs> And this was an informal settlement. Uh, C'était un, un settlement. Uh, It un, was a a a, 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 a Swatakam, tin houses, a ghetto, more than a ghetto. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, and uh, and I was born in the during the state of emergency in South Africa. Et je suis né dans le dans la période d'émergence d'urgence en Afrique. And it was the president was P W Water, and a lot there was a lot of protest and the burning of cars and the burning of everything. The country was on fire basically. Dans cette période, il y avait beaucoup de protestes en Afrique. It is said that the struggle for liberation of South Africa was fought in four-part harmony. La libération de l'Afrique du Sud était en quatre parties harmony, like in soprano, tenor, baritone, and bass. La libération de l'Afrique du Sud était composée de quatre parties, comme dans la musique. This is because we were singing all the time. Parce qu'on on on chantait tout le temps. And my interpretation is that that's why it lasted for so long because they thought we were enjoying. <laughs> Et mon interprétation c'est que c'est pour ça que ça a duré autant de temps parce qu'ils pensaient qu'on on, on, s'amuse avec ça. As a child, a 14 year old, I knew a sound of a gun, a caliber of the gun by its sound. Quand j'avais 14 ans, je pouvais reconnaître le calibre d'un pistolet quand j'entendais le son. It was like music. C'était comme de la musique. Because there was shooting every day. Parce qu'il tirait tous les jours. And that is the automatic Kalashnikov of 1947 from Russia. It's, a, it's got, a, it's got a, a prestigious sound. It makes no echo. Alors, 
<rire> ça c'est le son de, euh, de Glashnikov, hein, parce que les Russes. So, it goes. You don't have to translate that. And then there were the other guns, the R5 rifle. It goes. It's got a dual sound. The sound it makes when the striking pin hits the bullet and the sound it makes when the bullet leaves the barrel. So it makes two sounds. It goes But not all the time people fight in Africa. Sometimes they work, they earn a living. <laughs> and, and I want to talk about the migrant labor system where people are taken from their homeland, taken from lands taken, and then animals taken to work in the mines, to work in the city of Johannesburg and leave their homes there. Je veux vous parler de, 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 des gens, qui, des mineurs qui sont enlevés de leur terrain, de leur de terrain de travail, de leur village, pour les amener aux alentours de Johannesburg pour travailler dans les mines. There is something very interesting that happens in the mine when people go down 600 feet, or many, many, many kilometers or meters down the ground. Il y a quelque chose de très intéressant qui se passe quand les gens vont aller dans les mines très, très bas dans la terre. The gold that we are wearing in our wrists and our necks everywhere, and that people when they work, there is a lot of music that is being created there. L'or qu'on utilise dans nos bijoux partout dans notre vie, ces produits là-bas, quand il y a les gens, ils font de la musique, ils créent de la musique. And the intention is not to make music; it's to make, it's to earn a living. Et l'intention c'est pas de créer de la musique, mais c'est de gagner leur vie. Imagine this. Imagine ça. There are 500 men. Il y a 500 personnes. In deep in the belly of the earth. Très bas, profond dans le ventre de la terre. 
They can't communicate with each other because they come from different parts of Africa. Sometimes they can't communicate with their bosses. They can't take instructions very well. Parfois, ils peuvent pas très bien communiquer, même avec le chef. Ils peuvent pas prendre la solution très bien. And sometimes there's a lot of misinterpretations and mistranslations, like tonight. Et, <laughs> et, et parfois, il y a beaucoup de mistranslations comme ce soir. And in that, when the mind is active, et là-dedans, quand euh, l'esprit est active, There are machines. The drilling machine. Cling, cling, cling. The hammer. And the people say, What's the way now? Touch that one. What's the way Cling, cling. And the, that visceral energy of the working mind. Everybody have enjoyed it all over the world. 
from South Africa. It's called the Grand Bouddha Dance. Vous si vous allez vous va vous montrer une danse que tout le monde a eu le plaisir de le jouer partout dans le monde. But what I want you to remember, nobody, nobody sat down and said I want to choreograph this. Mais je veux vous vous rappeler que personne s'est assis pour dire que je vais choreographier ça.
even sung. Supposedly, it ended the genocide of many, many black people in South Africa. And there are some archive videos when you're watching a film, an old film of this song, when it's sad, you find a white policeman standing on the cusper and tapping on his R5 rifle. Disperse, disperse, or else we shoot. But the music is already has taken over the human body at that time to have an opportunity to be human and be affected by the music. That's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in those videos. And one day I was in Canada. The students were in protest and they said to me, please teach us a song that we can sing as we protest. L'Université au Canada et quelques étudiants m'ont demandé de, de leur apprendre une chanson pour uh, chanter quand ils protestent. And please translate what I said before. <laughs> I forgot to give you a chance. It is the policeman. Yeah. I remember. A policeman. Yeah. <laughs> un policier. Standing on top of the police car était sur un, une voiture de police and he's carrying an assault rifle je connais pas le nom fusil d'assaut and there's a thousand of children singing il y a des milliers des enfants qui chantent and he's tapping and he's tapping he's tapping his finger and for me it's the most beautiful thing what a lost opportunity there Mr. B, you can see you standing up. Are we okay? Good time. Yeah? No, no, I think. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry. Après, il dit, vous vous dispersez ou je vais, je, je vais tirer. Une fois, deux fois, mais la, la chanson s'est déjà partie très loin. On n'entend plus rien. Et il faut regarder ces vidéos. And nobody knows who composed this song. What's going on? <laughs> the freedom yes sir and when we speak of the freedom and then now since we are free <laughs> we are exposing things that came along with the freedom a <laughs> freedom of expression parce que tu nous as parlé de, de, de la liberté alors on, on en profite pour euh, montrer ce que la liberté nous a apporté <laughs> so now we want to come up with something alors on veut <laughs> I want to see this. Dini said you should not break this shoes. If we were not free, si on était pas libre, we were not going to come here on pas venir ici. and do the Gamboots dance, the Pansula dance, the Bodhi Pakashi, and probably tell stories through the music that we sing. 
Pierre ne sait pas lire, donc il ne peut pas faire ce qu'on est en train de faire. Alors, 